Welcome back to Monetized History. I'm Daniel, and today we are celebrating the 101st birthday of Eva Perón. She was born poor in western Argentina in 1919. When she was 15, she moved to Buenos Aires, then known as the Paris of South America. She found moderate success in film and radio, but her life changed in 1944 when she met Colonel Juan Perón, then Secretary of Labor, at a fundraising gala. Two years later, he would be president and she would be first lady. As First Lady, she worked tirelessly on social issues, working directly with the impoverished and fighting for women's suffrage. Soon, she eclipsed her husband's immense popularity. In August of 1951, at a rally of over two million, the crowd demanded she run for vice president, though she would eventually decline due to the cervical cancer she was battling. Her popularity was so great that during the final months of her life, she was officially named the spiritual leader of the nation. She died July 26, 1952. The outpouring of national grief was so great that the streets of Buenos Aires overflowed with flowers. Her body lay in state, an honor normally reserved for presidents for two weeks. A commemorative note was planned to be released but was abandoned when the military staged a coup and overthrew Juan Perón. She next appeared on local notes issued by La Rioja province in 2001 as debt cancellation bonds. Her latest banknote appearance was on the 100 peso note issued from 2012 to 2018. That's all for today. Thanks for watching. Do you have any money with Ava Perone on it? If so, let me know in the comments and don't forget to like and subscribe.